Welcome back and happy Tuesday. We're taking a look right now at the clouds and fog, mainly at a mid to high level. Yesterday we did have that dense fog throughout your morning drive. Not the case this morning. However, these clouds could actually linger well into your afternoon, especially towards the coast. Now let's take a look at some of these temperatures. We'll be right around the upper 40s for Paso Robles by 8 a.m. and closer to the low 50s for San Luis Obispo, Santa Maria, and Lompoc. So you can see that's a trend across some of your valley locations. And the afternoon temperatures will be actually a little bit cooler today. So it will be slightly cooler compared to what we had on Monday even. And if we take a look at these wind gusts, pretty calm. In some cases, if you're going to be towards some of those west facing beaches like Pismo Beach, Avila Beach, these wind speeds could kick up to about 15 miles per hour, but they will be pretty mild. And because of that, coupled with the marine layer, that's why we're expecting some of these cooler daytime highs. Let's take a look at the next three days as well. So you can see for the beaches back to the mid 60s tomorrow, upper 60s for your coastal valleys, mid 60s for the inland valleys. We could still have some lingering cloud cover by then that could carry over into your Thursday. And then Thursday night into Friday is when we actually have some rainfall potential. So if we take a look at what we can expect over the next 24 hours or so, we're taking a look at the barren model here. And you can see for the cooler daytime highs, I mentioned the onshore flow, that marine layer influence. That's why the temperatures are decreasing. And then we're taking a look at the high resolution forecast. This gives us an idea of what we can expect Thursday into Friday. So you see this system right here over Northern California. It will start to sweep towards the central coast. We can see that front making its way over our area and with it, it could bring some scattered shower potential and it is going to be really light. I can't emphasize that enough, but if we take a look at the forecast of precipitation again, you can see just how light it is. Maybe about a 10th of an inch of rain could be generated from this one. Other than that, by Friday morning, we'll likely see a lot of mist and drizzle out on the roads. But let's talk about these daytime highs. Low 60s for Paso Robles, same thing for San Luis Obispo. Back to the upper 50s though, for areas like Santa Maria and Lompoc. We have mid 60s for your South Coast region in Santa Barbara, low 60s for Goleta, Santana's Valley, and Cuyama. And for the five cities region, also cooling down there today as well, upper 50s. Similar conditions along the North Coast. And for San Miguel, 60 degrees, 57 for Atascadero. Back to you. Thanks, Brooke. The time is 5.30.